question number 25. In the fusion reaction, 1H2, 1H2 gives us 1H3, 1H3. Deuterium, 2 deuterium gives us tritium plus a hydrogen. Energy of 4 MeV is released. What is the specific energy of deuterium? Specific energy. What do you mean by specific energy? We have already seen energy per unit mass, right? So, what is the energy given out during this reaction? 4 MeV. 4 MeV divided by what is the mass of the deuterium which has been involved here? Do not take up only one of them. There are two deuteriums been involved over here to give this reaction. So, therefore, each deuterium will have an mass equal to 2U here. 2u here, so it is 4 times u, which should now be equal to 1 MeV divided by u over here. Now I need to substitute all the values, only then we get the correct answer. So which should now be equal to 1 million, this is 10 power 6 into 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 divided by what is u? 1.67 into 10 to the power of minus 27. But you see here, all the, the coefficients are being scraped out, right? Only you have 1 into 10 square, 1 into 10 power 8, and so on. What I will do is, I will take a shortcut here. I will put 1.6 here. 1.6, so 1.6 goes away. So, now if I do this, what do I get here? 10 power 6 minus 19 plus 27. Minus 27 goes up, but plus 27, which should now be 10 to the power of 27 plus 6 is 33. 33 minus 19, with a calculator, you can do much more faster. 13 minus 9 is 4. Then you have 2 minus 1 is 3. Uh, 2 minus 1 is 1. 10 to the power of 14. So, 10 to the power of 14, what is this unit here? Joules per kg. Now, you see, it's in terms of mega joules over here. Let me convert this. This should be 10 to the power of 8 plus 6. 8 plus 6 is 14, right? Because mega is 6 joules per kg, which should now be equal to 10 to the power of 10 to the power of 8 mega joules per kg. Don't just blindly take 10 power 14 and mark this one, okay? This is incorrect. So, this is the right answer, okay? 